Hello and welcome to another box opening video. In this video, we're going to unbox a Dollzone G0. The first thing I noticed about this is Dollzone has changed all their packaging. They have a new pamphlet type thing. Uh, it has various information on it. It's also written completely in Chinese. I don't know if they're going to translate that in the future. And they also changed their uh, little metal card thing. It no longer has Anson or Moment on it. It now has G0 on it. And they did not have a uh, artwork postcard. I wonder if the metal card is going to have an image of the actual doll you bought from now on, or if the metal card was just simply changed to G0. So if you've recently bought a doll from Dollzone, let me know if your metal card has G0 on it, or an image of the actual doll that you bought. And this part right here is the mask that goes over G0's face. These next pieces will be the blade type things that go on the headdress thingy. Not gonna lie, this looks like a bow. flat feet, because not even a cyborg can walk around in ballet stilettos. I don't understand why Dollzone sent one hand. I don't know if that was a mistake or on purpose because one of the hands is not at the resting position. I don't know. Now these larger headdress pieces, I did notice that there are spots on them that are very, very thin. So be careful not to uh, destroy them. Let's take a brief moment to admire the details on G-Zero's head. And the back of her head sort of looks like a butt, but I still love her anyway. And now, let's put her headdress together. I did notice that all the magnetic parts had extra magnets connected to them. So when you get your doll, make sure there's no extra magnets on that base one so that all your parts connect together properly. At this point, I still didn't realize that there were two extra magnets on everything. I was getting frustrated that everything didn't seem very secure when the magnets were connected. And that's all for G-Zero. Please like and subscribe.